always say that I Willow found me. And I always consider that I'm having a relationship with Willow. So my name is Elizabeth Murphy, but I get called Bet, Betty, Lizzie, or Liz, or anything else you're having. So it's a long name with a lot of other names, so I don't mind whatever you call me. I was involved with festivals. I got into festivals, so I was asked by a local festival in Newbridge, the Bialtina Festival, would I uh, make a wicker man? And of course I said, yes, I can make a wicker man. But I had no idea about Willow. I just said, yes, I'll make a wicker man. And I wasn't growing Willow at the time. I didn't know how to grow Willow. So um, I went along the canal banks and got Willow and made the wicker man. And I remember saying to my dad at the time, my dad would have been a, a man of the land, very connected with the land, and I, you know. So I remember saying to him, Dad, how do, you, how do you grow willow? And he just handed me two, what I call, sticks. He handed me two lumps of stick and he said, put them in the ground. And they were my instructions. And I think that's what brought me back to the land. I was looking for something at the time. I was dabbling everywhere. I, I did wood turn and I did wood carving. And then I found a willow. And I thought, you know, grand, I'll, make, I'll go over here and I'll make this shield or I'll make this basket. And you know, we'll go. I was open to, I was on the, basically on the hunt for some kind of change. You know, I, I office work just didn't do it for me. You do need to understand the material. You need to know what you're working with. You know the strengths of the willows. You need, there's a lot in the prep of the willow. You know how to prepare the willow. You know, that's a, it's a years of learning. I like to work with people. I like to go out into the community. I like to go into schools. I mean, the bonus I get from people, working with people, the, you know, the connecting with people, the smiles it brings to their faces, uh, the achievement, you know, it's like even little kids. And, you know, people say, oh, kids these days, you know, they, you know, they're just lost on technology. But, you know, it's not that they're lost on technology. It's that they don't have the opportunity to connect with simple because, I mean, their kids are so proud of what to do. And to see that, there's other makers who wouldn't go near working with people because it drives them mad. People drive them mad. But for me, it's where it's at. So I choose that. I'll choose community work. You know, one of the little projects we're doing at the moment um, in a school in Tala is that they're making Christmas stars. They make two Christmas stars, one to bring home for themselves, to give as a gift, and one for the Christmas fair instilling confidence in kids and adults I mean I work with both children and adults of all needs and I have witnessed people you know just coming from a place of just feeling that they couldn't they're not creative that they're just you know they can't they're not you, you know to wow this is amazing like It doesn't matter what class I walk into and if I know there's always a few characters you know I, I just that doesn't phase me at all because I'm just sitting back waiting for the willow to work its magic it's that the willow will sort it out like that the materials come in that they can actually grow materials in their garden at school they can actually process the materials they can go out and gather the materials to see where it's coming from you're working with natural materials. I don't want to put any uh, uh, pressure on myself, you know. <laughs> you have to take these things very easy, you know. Life is, life is short. 
life is short so you have to and when you've got so much going on you want to connect you need you know the seasons are so fast you know they pass you by so quick and you're like oh that's happening already you know so it's like you know you're you know it's it's the thing about connection staying connected all the time you know take it slow